Well, welcome back. Our second Memorial Day special train is another one from what collectors call new marks or Ameritrains. Their proper name at the time was Marks Trains. Later they changed their name to Ameritrains. So this is this is from the earlier uh, version of the company, if you will. It's a, a very fine United States Army train and has two more units than the last one we showed. Here we have a, a nicely lithographed engine. The tender is a uh, oil type ten tender versus a uh, uh, coal tender. It has the Marks Military Corps mobile barracks just like the last train did. But this one has a fuel oil tanker, an ordnance gondola with nine simulated trench bags and nine ammo rounds. This too has the United States Army Bureau of Ordnance boxcar, just like the last one. But we have a searchlight car, a flat car with an amphibious vehicle, the DUKW, also called the Duck, and a Bayside caboose uh, repurposed as a U.S. medical unit. Now, with all the ordnance on this train, man, if anything ever happened and this thing blew, uh, I'm afraid the guys in that caboose are history. I, I'm serious. They're toast. I mean, look, we got fuel, oil, artillery rounds, and an ordnance boxcar. Ah! Let's hope nothing happens. This is a heavy train. The, the tenders on these, I notice, are weighted down. Uh, but the this ordnance gondola is also pretty heavy. And I don't know. It just It just seems like a heavy train. So, you know what? Let's put her through the paces. Let's see what she does. Now, I'm going to back it up. Oh, and just for excitement, ha uh, ha. We're going to run it in the opposite direction. Oh, joy. So, anyway. Let's see what this gorgeous train will do. Jerk. That's what it does. It goes backwards. Fine. There we go.